Now faced with a third president in 10 years after Dr. Doran had served 23, turned again to the board to search for the new president. The campus turned to Dean of Higher Education in the state of Kentucky, A.D. Albright, to come out of retirement to help heal the school. Dr. Albright led a transitional year that saw the return of former Dean C. Nelson Grody as the campus's 11th president in 1987. Dr. C. Nelson Grody, former Dean of Applied Sciences, had applied for the president's position before the hiring of Reinhardt. Dr. Grody returned to what he and his family felt was home in Moorhead. I determined that if I was going to come back to Moorhead, and that was my dream from that, from the, from the time I came here, and watching Dr. Dorn and watching the university, I dreamed of becoming president of Moorhead State, and I tried to prepare myself for that. In the 16 years we were gone, in learning how to be a president, I we subscribed to the Moorhead paper for 16 years, Moorhead News and um, read it better than people back here. People back here would read certain things, we read it all. We were better informed than a lot of people here, and we would call, telephone calls from Spokane, because of the distance. But when we were in Michigan for 10 years, we came here every year to, for a visit. After the president had resigned, I became a candidate and I was invited for an interview. I kept saying, I want to come home. Uh, but in, within a couple of days, I got a telephone call and they said, we want you to be our next president. I'd wanted that for 16 years. I considered it the epitome, the epitome of my career. I came here because I thought I could put this place back together again. I came here to help my university that I loved, that showed. I love this university. If you can love a university, I don't know, I think you can. I loved it, but I loved it as I remembered it, partly, and it was fun to be here. That's all I can say. I just had a joyous time here. <laughs>